the main thing I love the most about it is building the relationships with our players. I love just being a part of young people's lives, a part of watching them grow. I think we live in a society a lot of times, it's all about me. But in sports, it, it can't be about you, it's about the team. I hope I inspire them. Yell at them a lot, Nate. No, uh, you know, I think seeing um, example of just passion that, I, that I, I've always tried to coach with, uh, preparation, uh, excitement for the game, love for the game, detailed of it, be intentional in terms of how they're doing off the court, on the court. We wanted to know that they were loved by our coaching staff and our teachers. Um, that they've always got somebody in their corner that they can count on, and that we just wanted to see them be the best version of themselves and nothing else. Attitude and effort is a huge part. If you come out with a great attitude um, and you work hard, then nothing but positive things are gonna come to you. I always try to tell them that I believe in them constantly, that they need to believe in themselves and believe in their teammates. I think that self-confidence, helping boost their self-confidence and encouraging them to make mistakes. You're supposed to make mistakes, that's how you learn. Just teaching them perseverance. I think athletics ties into everything else we, we want our kids to be. We, we want them to be disciplined. We want them to have commitment and accountability and, and athletics plays a big part in, in fostering those things in our students. When they are in their family life and in their, um, their work life, they're always going to be able to take some aspect of being a part of a team sport and apply it to their future lives. What I try to do is to inspire them to be a part of something bigger than self, because that's really where you get a lot of satisfaction and joy, even if it's when you're done playing, that whether you're part of a family or part of a business or a company or a church or, or a school, you know, that you're a part of something bigger than yourself. 